you. Okay. Let's see. And you know, just being one of the people that get to visit the moon would be a privilege and an honor. So being the first, I never like being the first because there's a huge amount of responsibility for that, right? Um, I wouldn't mind doing that, but and I'm willing to take on that responsibility, but it's, it's always better to me, like being the second or third. You kind of just go and do your job and enjoy it, really, really enjoy it. And then um, do make some kind of contribution to um, the earth as a whole, not just the United States, but discover something, help discover something. Um, in a, in a quiet way, <laughs> not being the first. Oh no, I'm excited about the fact that we have an administrator that really wants to um, do something big and wants to continue this um, to see it through to the end. We, um, we now have some funding that will help us get there and be able to do this um, hopefully by 2024. I'm glad that someone put a, a stake in the, in the sand and said 2024. Well, uh, there's always a ton of people to look up to. Um, of course, you know, the people who started this, Neil Armstrong, all the early astronauts, Valentina Tereshkova, um, Mae Jemison, um, so many people, but the person who had the biggest impact on me was my mother. She was not a scientist or an engineer, but um, she encouraged me to just be who I was and encouraged me to go forward. She never made it seem odd that I wanted to do these things. And so to me, to be able to do these things, of course I'm gonna do these things. It's not an odd thing. Because it's visible, Hopefully it'll have a huge impact on not just my generation, but the next generation and the ones after that. But also discovering new um, potential medicine, um, uh, countermeasures for the human body, um, for um, you know, changes in our DNA, different things that we're gonna discover. is gonna be very, very visible. We can talk about it. No, I don't consider um, the astronauts heroes. We're the ones that get to do these things um, because of the people here on the ground who are the real heroes who help us get there and bring us back home. So we're, we're lucky that we're able to do this in space. Very lucky.